All right, we're taking a look here at backends, and each Terraform configuration can specify a backend which defines where and how operations are performed and where state snapshots are stored. So Terraform divides their backends into two types. We have standard and enhanced. First, looking at standard, this is where you can only store the state. Uh, and it does not perform Terraform operations such as Terraform Apply. So to perform operations, you have to use a CLI on your local machine. Uh, and the reason why is that standard backends are basically third-party backends. So a standard backend could be AWS S3. And so, you know, this is a stored service. It doesn't have the capabilities of programmatically triggering things, okay? Uh, when we have, when we're talking about enhanced backends, we can store both the state and perform Terraform operations. So enhanced backends are subdivided further. So we have local, so files and data are stored on the local machine executing Terraform commands and remote. So files and data are stored in the cloud, so Terraform cloud. The reason why they can perform Terraform operations, and when you look at local and remote, local is your machine. So of course, it can execute Terraform. And then remote is Terraform Cloud, which has its own runtime environment. It's basically a build server. So it, of course, uh, can do both those operations. And that's how you're going to remember the difference between those two, OK?